G'day everyone, welcome back to another episode. Today is very exciting because it's the day that I get to reveal to you my little daily. Low key excited, but anyway. What we're gonna do is we're gonna pimp our little daily. I did buy a daily when I bought this house. I bought it because I didn't wanna run the patrol, especially on these big boy 37s, um, back and forth to my job. I bought a $1,400 Honda Civic, and I've always been like a bit of a JDM guy, so pretty excited to do this actually. And I hope you guys are actually gonna be interested in this because I know this is a full driving channel, but I figured we'd change content up just a little bit. I actually just love working on cars, period, not just full drives. But today, it's a little Honda Civic. The new Fast and Furious was horrible and it did not fill the spot that I needed in my heart for my little JDM, um, little JDM, little battery in here just ticking along. So let me show you guys the daily and then we can get cracking on the mods. So what we're doing today is we've got a set of wheels right here. The shiny boy wheels. I got these off Marketplace. They're only $500. They're bloody sick. Coilos, black and red, to uh, match the theme of the shed. So these are what's going to allow us to adjust the ride height as basically as low as we want. Yeah. I no, reckon just suck it on his guts. Just dialing it in. Shouldn't get any rubbish. Might be the best game changing civic build in the world, but it's happening. And yeah. we, we just can't stop it. Damn boy! Dude, that's tucking like. It's not even rubbing. Credit card fitment. That's like what you want. That's good. It's insane. Wheels need a clean. Yeah, a bit of paint flaky, mate. All woods. I did explain when the camera was messing up, but these are the coilovers set up from Max Peating Rods. Their company is there. These guys sent this out completely free of charge, so massive shout out to them. They're also offering a 15% discount to anyone who's watching this video on their store. And they don't just have suspension, they've got pretty much, um, they've got a lot of stuff. So check it out. The code is Rome Life if you guys want to see. This build would not be possible without Max Peating Rods. <laughs> Shout out to the boys. So the car itself is 95 um, Honda Civic EG and I've always been sort of a fanboy for little Hondas so that's why we're doing this. This is my daily driver at the moment. I don't drive Cole at all during the week. He's just a weekend car. But this little shrimp is, um, <laughs> its name is Little Shrimp. Hey Ryan. Little Shrimp. Little Shrimp. This little shrimp has been my daily driver for the past eight weeks and I'm absolutely loving it. I've already done a rear main seal in the motor. I pulled the gearbox off and done that after work one night, but we want to tidy it up. I hate driving stock cars, so that's where these fat boy wheels are coming in. Man, I'm fast moving everything, including in bed. I call them different to me, hey? I call, I call this the rim. Yeah. And then I call the whole thing the wheel, and then I call the tire the tire. Right. Yeah. So what's a rim job then? Well, that's when a girl licks your butt. <laughs> <laughs> this is so much easier than the 37. <laughs> oh, I'm loving the truth. This is gonna be, is gonna be sick. Up. <laughs> oh no! Yeah, we need oh, oh, no. Get the jacket! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's crazy. Dude, that's so low. Oh no, that actually looks pretty cool. Oh, the ground is right. <laughs> <laughs> that was 
8 минут. <laughs> Look sick. You know what they need? They need a big dirt nasty pod. Yeah, it does. Dude. How sick does it look? It looks insane. It's nuts. It's so funny though. It's so lucky. <laughs> Wait, the boot will go under the Carl's tray. Brian's repairs. Drift stitching. This is a 101. Oh. Let me start again. <laughs> this is just a basic tool to hold your bumper on. Seen quite commonly in the drift scene. Uh, commonly known as drift stitching. It's dope as How much horsepower do you reckon this will add? It's approximately five horsepower per zippy tie. Per, and how many zippy ties are there? Six. So we're gonna add about 30 horsepower with this modification. Tom's going to get a Rome Life window banner. Due to its size, the Rome Life window banner will actually add another 30 horsepower. Yeah, it started off with 620. Yep. We're adding 60 horsepower, so that gives us about a 1,045 total. Everyone laughed at me when I bought this Civic, but look at him now. Oh, I'm the one laughing now. <laughs> look at how well these wheels just came up after a quick wipe. I can't believe that. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, look at this wheel. Oh wow! <laughs> that's sick. Oh, that's sick. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> you you bunged up one hole, but that's all all goods. Ryan's repairs, eh? <laughs> this thing's turning out to be a little weapon. We got a little shrimp, and we got big coal. Actually, small coal on 33s, but. Yeah. Soon to be big coal back on 37s. It's so funny because the wheels look like they don't belong on the car. Because the well, car's the such a shit. they do. Yeah, like the car's such a shit box. Like, it looks like someone's gone out and like, bought like. makes it look cool though. Yeah. <laughs> so, finishing touches. The only one I've got left. Literally the only one. Very nice banner. Shed life, brother. Oh, he's still... Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, he scraped! <laughs> oh, that's uncomfortable. I think it's just this one. <laughs> right as you said that. <laughs> 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 right, so even though it looks absolutely insane that low, we just about hit every single pump yeah. on the road. And the sun plug on this is the first thing that's going to hit, so it does need to come up in the front just a little bit. I'm just going to lift it up a bit and then I'm going to bash these guards in and then we'll call it a night. Righto, so the Civic's adjusted. We've got a finger depth and I've also taken the inside fender lining out and um, bash this more. So we've got heaps clearance in the front now. It shouldn't be scrubby dub dubbing. And we're gonna take it for a test drive, but it's obviously nighttime now, so we're not gonna be able to film anymore. So I love these little mods that just transform a car so easily. Thanks heaps for watching, guys. Catch you on the next episode. Thanks heaps, Ryan. See ya, mate. Can't even see ya. Say bye. Bye. bye.